Hey guys, Brooklyn Boys here, and welcome to day four of Brooklyn Boys Gamus. We're no longer using that long title, we're shrinking it. Yep. So, recapping, we don't have the calendar behind us yet, and we're in a new venue for the next couple of episodes. So, recapping, like I was saying, day one, we had the Final Fantasy XIV Collector's Edition. We had the God of War Saga, which collects the first five games of God of War. We have Medal of Honor 2010 with the addition of Medal of Honor Frontline. Yep. And now today, we have a game that a lot of you guys um, are familiar with. We've played it not only on Brooklyn Boys 13, I've not only played it on Brooklyn Boys 13, but we also played, I think, two games on uh, BBC 13 Gaming connected with this game. And uh, you guys are going to be shocked that I didn't have this game until right now, but... The game is Dead Space 3. This is the limited edition. I ordered it as Dead Space 3. I guess all the Dead Space 3s were limited edition. But anyway, um, you guys are familiar. I played Dead Space from the first game all the way through to Extraction to Part 2. And now we've got the third installment. I'm positive that this isn't going to be the last. I'm almost positive this isn't going to be the last. I have no clue. But this is the first one that we actually have on the PlayStation uh, Network. Uh, the first two games we have are from Xbox 360. Uh, the Extraction game, which took place between uh, 1 and 2, um, we got the Wii uh, console that was exclusive to the Wii until, of course, number 2 came out. And then on 2, if you got the Collector's Edition, you got a free D uh, downloadable content uh, DLC, which gave you Extraction as well on the Xbox. But nothing will beat the um, experience uh, on the Wii system because that has the Wiimote and everything whereas uh, Xbox, I don't know if it was Kinect, uh, where it worked with the Kinect or whatever, but anyway I decided to get Dead Space 3 on the PlayStation 3 because um, honestly I don't really play too much on the Xbox 360 anymore especially after we've upgraded our systems to the Xbox One and, and um, PlayStation 4 uh, I decided to stick with the PlayStation 3, so we officially have a Dead Space game on every console now, and I know a lot of you guys did ask me when I was going to play PlayStation, uh, the um, Dead Space 3. Uh, I honestly put it off for a while. When it first came out, I was saying, I'm going to get it, I'm going to buy it before it even comes out, and um, I'm going to play it on Brooklyn Boys 13, and unfortunately, I don't remember what the circumstances were at the time, but at the time of its release, I was unable to get it, and then... Uh, other things came about, all in all, basically, we're a year, it's a year later, because this came out in 2013, and here it is. So, now the Frontline Gaming Zone, I will be playing the third installment of Dead Space at yeah, some point. I mean, I mean, I have a huge history with Dead Space. Yeah, I mean, you played, uh, but you were having Dead Space 1, 2, and Extraction, and the DVDs actually came out too. for uh, that as well. Dead Space 3, there's a lot of stuff uh There's co-op in here. To. Yeah, and uh, that uh, main character, Isaac Newton. Clark. What? Newton? Isaac Newton? I, really? I thought it was Newton. I was like, Mixing your history with your gaming history, are you? Isaac Clark. Isaac Newton. Is the ga don't, don't you laugh at me. Isaac Clark Isaac is the main Newton. character in this How game. How do you call... Well, anyway, you play as him in the game, and uh, it actually... Um, when you face off against these monsters and everything, who knows what more uh, is going to come out of this. Hopefully on Frontline Gaming Zone, there is a co-op, like I said. Hopefully, I know Brant has a PlayStation 3, but his Dead Space 3 is on the Xbox 360. Uh, he's going to see if he could switch it uh, at a game store for the PlayStation 3. If so, me and Brant will be doing a co-op. This is the first Dead Space game that had co-op on it, and a lot of people were complaining about that because it's no longer that alone in the dark thing. But... Uh, if Brand does get it for the PlayStation 3, which I'm hoping he will, um, Brand and I both will be playing Dead Space 3 on Frontline Gaming Zone. Ooh, Hopefully soon. This is going to be one of those sooner rather than later games that I play on Frontline Gaming Zone. Uh, out of all the games we're getting from Gamers. So. This is a huge staple in the Brooklyn Boys franchise. Because yep. we've been following this since the first game. Absolutely. So I'm looking forward to doing number 3. Yep. And that's it for day 4. 21 more days to go. <laughs> Thank you for correcting me. Thank you. People know what I'm talking about. You go too like this. So I would Let's to... rock on. Anyway, we will see you guys tomorrow for day five. Day five is going to be a great one, I think. We're randomly picking them as we go, so we don't know what day five will be yet. But we have a lot of really great games to come. 
not only for this week, but for the following weeks. So stick around, and we'll see you guys tomorrow for another day of Brooklyn Boys Advent Game Miss. Yep, so we'll see you then. Take care, guys.